Hi guys, so today I did this look, which is just a bright pink look. Um, the colors don't really show up on the camera, but um, my inspiration was this like bowl of flowers, I guess. My mom frequently goes to Hawaii and she always buys these lays. So, um, like it even says Hawaii on it. And um, she just collects them and puts them in this little basket, I guess. And the bright pink colors like really jumped out at me. So I wanted to do a look based off the flowers. And I forgot to add in the end of my video that um, you could add a clip to make it really festive and pretty. So yeah, I hope you guys like it and let me know if you have any questions. Bye! Okay, so I already primed my eyes with Too Faced Eyeshadow Insurance. So the next step you're gonna... The next step. The next step is to take your matte color in Sushi Flower. Ooh, it's kind of washed out, but... It's a bright pink color. And just a normal shading brush like this. And you're gonna, you're gonna apply that right on your lid. Just patting in the color. And then you're also going to want to start blending it into your crease. Don't pick up any more color, just use the same brush. And just move the shadow around. Okay. And then after that, you're going to take... A fluffy brush like this and Max Expensive Pink, which is a shimmery um, pink color. So you're going to blend that right into your crease. Blending it out with um, Sushi Flower in a nice windshield wiping motion. And you're just going to leave a little bit of space right here for your highlight. Just like that. As a highlight, I'm going to be using Satisfy, which is this cream color right there. It's very close to vanilla. Vanilla's right there. And you're going to take just a round brush like this, a C brush, ooh, my hair, and apply it under your brow bone as a highlight. So I heard USPS and I'm expecting a package, which I will show you guys once I get it, which is hopefully today. Okay, once you do that, take that blending brush you used earlier and just blend your um, expensive pink into the highlight. I personally don't like highlights to be really obvious, like, hi, this is white because it's my highlight. I like to blend my crease color into it very slightly, not so this is the same color as my crease, but just so it um, it matches better. As you can tell, you can still see, maybe you can't see, oops, there's a difference between my highlight and my crease and my lid, but not too much where um, it's like white, pink, pink, you know? Just nicely blended. Move this back. Okay. So your eyes or your eyeshadow is done at least. All you have to do now is apply eyeliner. I'm gonna be using Hips um, Cream Liner, their Color Truth Cream Eyeliner, and a bent eyeliner brush. 
and I'm just going to line my eye. There we go. And then to line my waterline and tight line, I'm going to be using Max um, Smolder Eye Coal, which is just a black. I need to sharpen this. Mine's really dull. Okay, and then I also set my eyeliner so it doesn't crease with carbon. So I use this um, small angled brush and I just pat it onto the liner that I just made. And it helps seal the eyeliner so it doesn't um, smear on you. Especially in the corner right there. That's where I get a lot of smearing and stuff. So there we go. All we have to do now is mascara. I'm using Lash Blast by CoverGirl, of course. This is running out soon, though, so... I have a, a buxom lash ready to go once this runs out. Ooh, you can't see me anymore. Sorry. Don't mind my messy room. I'm living out of my luggage for a while. Okay. So I applied a generous amount onto my lids. And now I'm oops. Now I'm just gonna curl it with my shoe Amora. And I pump it about 30 times. Okay. And then while I wait for the top one to um, sort of dry, I just apply some on my bottom lashes. Some mascara, I mean. And then I go back and reapply some onto my um, top lashes. There we go. And then for lips, I'm going to be using Max. Um, I think this is a Luster. Luster in California Dreamin'. It was a, a special... Oh, it's hard to talk with lipstick. I only put a little because it's very pigmented and I don't want it to be too pink. And then I also like to top it off with Max Luster Glass and Love Nectar. This is like my favorite color of all time. And there you go. And for my um, blush and stuff, I didn't really do blush. I, um, oh, there's something in my eye. Anyway, I just applied um, like a bronzer type thing and I used my Bare Essentials um, Warmth. So, yeah, this is my look. I hope you guys liked it and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.